YouTube. It is currently 9.23. Today is Wednesday. I'm currently making some oatmeal for breakfast. We have a ton of fruit, so I'm going to use up a ton of fruit in this batch of oatmeal I'm making. I use milk, chia seeds, sometimes nuts, and um, fruit in my oatmeal usually. So like banana slices, blueberries. And there we have it. Oatmeal with chia seeds, bananas, and blueberries. Look at that. Looks amazing. Okay, sitting here still eating my oatmeal. It is 9.45, almost 9.45. And I have my therapy appointment at 11 and I'm hoping that you know I it's quiet <sighs> this was not really how I wanted this morning to go I was kind of hoping that they would uh, be awake my niece and sister are still sleeping upstairs which is why I got up at like 9 15 and just pulled myself out of bed as you can see normally I would be already dressed however excuse my spoon there but however that did not end up happening because I, you know, need to shower, need to pull myself together, and I can't do that if the bedroom's occupied. Another thing I wanted to do today was see about scheduling my next haircut because it's getting to that time where I'm getting very flustered and very frustrated with how this hair looks. You can even see over here how it looks all wavy right here. I have a natural wave to my hair no matter how I cut it. I just have a natural wave to it. And you can see right here where my hand is, how long it is because it's growing, it's growing out. I'm hoping to call soon to see if I can schedule the appointment. I was hoping to do it for today to just get over with. Getting my hair cut is like my stress relief because it's my 30 minutes of pure peace and quiet. Just 30 minutes of relaxation. I get my hair washed. I get to talk to the stylist in there. We've all become kind of really close. And, you know, I'm just, you know, grateful that it's across the street as well. But I'm starting to look just a little frazzled, as you can see. It's not horrible, but you can see the back of it has the grown out Wolf hairs is what my stylist and I call them. I've seen this a lot, whereas people are already taking down their Christmas decorations like a day or two days after Christmas. We usually keep ours up until like at least the first or second week of January. We keep them up to enjoy the other holiday that we have, which is New Year's, which is next weekend. I still can't believe that. We only have Thursday, Friday, because today is Wednesday already. Thursday, Friday, and then Saturday's New Year's Eve. It's like, oh my gosh. That is that is just crazy how fast. I feel like 2022 is just zooming by. Does anybody else feel that way? Because uh, I sure do. That 2022 is just zooming by and wants to leave. But if I'm being quite honest, I kind of do want 2022 to leave and just say goodbye to it because I feel like it's just been dragging, dragging on. And you guys know it's just been a crazy, crazy year. If you watch my past vlogs, you know that it's just been crazy for me. Anyways, everybody is pretty much still, like, resting upstairs, kind of just getting themselves together. And I am, like, the only kid, adult aunt that's down here awake. <laughs> that being said, I'm going to take a little bit to myself and it's like, but the thing, the thing that bugs me is that I don't want to take my computer out and then have to take it all the way upstairs. So I'm trying to wait it out, but I can't really wait much longer. <laughs> Let me rephrase. I shouldn't wait too much longer when it reaches like 10, 15. I should be, you know, prepping, ready upstairs, all that kind of thing. But I think if I do call to make this appointment, I'll probably call it around that time as well, just to get all my ducks in a row and then shower after, depending on if I get the appointment for today. All right, you guys, it is now 12.47. I just got out of the shower not too long ago. I'm all dressed, ready to go, waiting for my appointment to be all set up and ready. I have about 10 minutes. 
I just scheduled my haircut for tomorrow at noon, so I'm super excited for that. Tomorrow at noon, it's going to be a good rest of the week. Why? Why is this doing this? My, my email is being really weird. Oh, it has just been kind of a rush. I set everything up in the bedroom so that my niece and sister could have the downstairs. They were originally going to come up here, but I had already set up everything up here. I'm not sure how long this is going to take. I do plan on going for a walk when I'm done with this. I don't really have anything else to do. I did some laundry. I mean, I have hopefully some more laundry to do at some point, but not today because I did a load yesterday. But, uh, tomorrow is my haircut at noon, so I gotta be ready for that. And, like I said, hopefully it'll be good vibes the rest of... <laughs> day. I know my vlogs have been a little wonky. Please bear with me. This vlog will be going up for tomorrow and then I'll be taking a break for New Year's weekend. Ignore my hair. I'm gonna fix it. But I did just finish getting ready. <clears throat> just some black jeggings and then this pink like Valentine's Heart t-shirt but I wear it year round. I don't care. The holiday and then I'm currently fixing my hair. Today, I actually, if you missed yesterday's footage, today I'm actually getting my hair cut this afternoon. And I'm going to make this all fresh for the new year. I'm actually doing something a little different, but I want to keep that a surprise. Um, I'm doing something a little different. I think I've spoken about it before, um, but I'm not sure if any of you um, would remember what I'm talking about. So I just want to wait until then and show you guys. Today, I'm actually going to, surprise, surprise, wear my Converse sneakers because it's actually not that bad out. It's going to be near in the upper 40s and 50s the rest of the week, which which is called calling for all the rain we're supposed to be getting. Obviously, I want to be careful because there are some icy patches still, but with all the warm weather we're going to be getting, everything is melting. Like, there's, there's no need to keep wearing white boots if there's no snow or rain on the ground or anything. Another thing I'm going to be doing today is washing my sheets. Before I leave to go for my haircut, I'm going to start those washing. And then I'm going to go for an afternoon walk. And then I have to run some errands while I'm out this afternoon. I am just glad that today I get to do another day of my routine. You guys know I'm very routine based. I get to get my hair cut and be nice and relaxed and just 
have that self-care which is much needed. I wanted to quickly talk about some of the products that I like to use when getting ready. I just have these pearl ear these um like rose gold pink pearl earrings in. And that's with my pink and black that I'm going with today. One of the products that I use today, I actually have two of them. It's the Body Ecology brand Cucumber Melon Fragrance Mist. It's like a it's a body spray that I'll use on occasion, not every day, but it's nice. I also have this was a given or I found it somewhere, but it's a um, body splash spray, the same brand, Body Ecology. It smells really good as well. So if anybody is in the market for something, for a good price of something, Body Ecology from Walmart is a recommend. So it's now noon and I'm heading over for my haircut because it's about to start. I just gotta get in there, check in, make sure everything's in order, get the haircut, and then I'll be getting out in the sunshine for a walk. I wanna take a walk, probably come back and not wear this coat because it's honestly, it's gonna be near 50 like I mentioned earlier the rest of the week, but I'm just wearing it for now. Um, because of washing my hair. Fun fact about me, I hate it when the hoods of anything that I'm wearing, whether it be a sweater or like a coat or whatever, gets wet. I don't like it. But I will show you guys my hair when I am all finished. It should only take 25 to 30 minutes. And then I'm gonna drop my stuff off and then head out on this beautiful day for a walk. There's a fan on right here, but I wanted to show you guys. Look at the hair, I'm so obsessed. Look at it. Look at the back, this side, this side here got a fade. She did a really nice job. Really, really like it. I feel so good. I just love it when I get my hair cut. It's the version of self-care that I love, and I only do it at least every two months. Sometimes I'll do three. It depends on the time of year and my financial situation. My financial's fine. Doing a lot better with saving. But, you know, you just got to think of your priorities. Oh, my goodness, you guys. It is gorgeous out here. This breeze. It's not too cold. I'm out here in just a hoodie in the end of December. Normally, it's freezing in the end of December. And it's in the 50s, and it's supposed to rain this weekend. You guys can see the fade on the side. I showed you guys in the bathroom. There it is. You guys, this is crazy. There is all of this ice. This is all still ice over. It's probably, like, slightly slushy. But look at this. It goes all the way down there. How warm it is going to get. Prob hopefully all that ice will melt because that is a good amount of ice. Everything sometimes floods with a lot of rain. So I think that's what happened with all of that. And it just iced over. When's the last time you guys saw me wearing a hoodie? Just a hoodie, this maroon hoodie that I got for Christmas back in, I want to say, 2017 when we first moved in the end of December. It's the 29th, and I have a hoodie on. 
Is it bad to say that I am totally obsessed with this fade? I love it. It was my mother's suggestion, and we're definitely going to be doing it from now on every time I get a haircut because I'm literally obsessed with the beautiful weather today. Everything feels so nice. But it's now 1.45, and I'm still walking. I'm going to soak up as much sun as I possibly can because it's just so beautiful out here. I'm gonna wrap this up. Thank you guys so much for watching and coming along with me today. Thank you all so much for watching. Be sure to hit the red subscribe button down below so you don't miss out on future content. And like always, I will see you guys in the next